Lucas. This is Bill, the corporate manager. As you know, money transfer outlets. Uh, I have two housekeeping items for you, sir. First off, I need to know what you want me to do with the uh, physical card, the actual physical Visa debit card that we sent you your money, uh, that we loaded your money on. Do you want me to send it to you? Do you want me to turn it over to Mrs. Harris or one of her colleagues, such as uh, Michael or Bob? Um, I need to know, uh, I need you to get back to me on that. I need to know what you want me to do with your card. Uh, secondly, I'm a bit, I uh, was a bit surprised to see that you haven't taken the time to, um, give us the five-star review that I'm uh, fairly confident that we've earned, uh, from you, uh, with this transaction. So if you could take a few minutes and get that five-star review onto, uh, onto Google for us, I sure would appreciate it and uh, either give me a phone call or shoot me a text back and let me know where to send the uh, actual physical card if you want it sent to you i need your address in nigeria uh, otherwise uh, i can turn it over to whomever uh, you'd like me to turn it over to but i need you to uh, let me know thank you name phone number and a brief Listen, message. I don't care if you think I don't care. As soon as possible. No. Thanks. I don't care if you think I've had enough. Give me another drink. Give me another Jack and Coke right now. I don't care. Lucas, this is Bill, corporate manager. You're trying to cost me my job. Cause... Give me another drink. I don't care if you think I had enough. You're trying to cost me my job, and you're causing me problems with Mrs. Harris. You and your whole worthless family, your worthless mama, your worthless papa, are, um, your papa cleans toilets, and your mama is a village of I will, I will... Worthless, worthless... Stop lying in my name, and stop stealing Mrs. Harris's money. Lucas, it's Bill, Money Transfer Outlets. Why in the f*** are you lying to Mrs. Harris and telling her I didn't send you the money? I, you chose the Visa card option of the three options I gave you. I loaded $5,000 onto the Visa card and sent you the information via text message since you refused to give me an email address. F*** you for lying, you worthless, greedy p***. May God punish you and thunder your whole worthless thief. Good day. Listen, you mother You're fired. I'm going to nails. I'm going to Mrs. Harris, it's Bob. Um, I am not angry that you fired me, but I'm concerned about the circumstances under which it happened. It seems there's been a great deal of miscommunication and a whole lot of untruths, lies, and innuendo on the part of certain people. Now, I mailed that money. That money made it to Washington State. And that Mrs. Jennifer and Mr. Jennifer clearly ran off with the money. Uh, as I've told Lucas, I have the postal inspector looking at this. And the postal inspector told me that... Uh, they have their eyes on those two. They're known. They're known criminals. 
Uh, it turns out that they are addicted to and uh, Mr. Jennifer seems to have a certain and with other men and so no wonder Lucas keeps complaining about how Mrs. Jennifer's marriage is breaking up but it's not breaking up due to anything involved with this missing transaction and I need to make it patently clear that I have done everything by the book, by the numbers, and according to the law. And yet here we are talking about two people who Lucas assumes are of upright and moral character, and yet everything we know about the two says otherwise. So here I'm dealing with a fat Who else or what else are they? They're very people, Mrs. Adriana. Now, I wish to work with you as we have always had a good relationship and I am very certain that we can get this sorted out because as I have proven to you, all the trails lead back to Lucas. And it is time for Lucas to step up. He needs to apologize. He needs to say, all right, all right, all right, Mrs. Harris, Mr. Bob, I, I, I own this. I and once he does that, I'm sure all of his barriers to to whatever his problems are, they they will they will fall, and he will see his life is blessed and kind. Thank you, Mrs. Harris. Hey, finally, you want to fight? Okay, I'm listening. I put out the call now. I'm listening. What's your problem? What's your problem? Yeah, problem you put me on the speaker. Ah, wanna, you record my voice? I, I record your voice. I, okay, let's record each other. What do you want? You want, you want from me? Ah, uh, what do you want from me? Exactly. Yeah, tell me. What do you want from me? No, you have to tell me. What is your problem with that Jennifer? She's a thief. Come on, talk to me. Ah, you don't want to talk. You want to hear my voice. Okay. That's all? No, I don't want to stop. What is your problem with Emeka? Can I know? I'm, I'm telling you that Emeka has three children. How do you know, uh, Niger boy? You just you say you are you not a Nigerian. A you just you, you say you are not a Nigerian. Have, How do you know have, so well about Nigerians? If you are not a Nigerian, me. huh? You are very. Can't you see how you are? Has anybody told you? People. Has I anybody told you in this life? You are. Am I the first person? The most no, I'm you, not. No, I'm are, not. The most no, I'm not. Singing. You are. You are a, a brainless. You are a. Why can't you just fall in love with your husband? Your drug. It your is drug not boy. your problem. It is not your, your problem. Your puppet, it's your not your boy. problem. You are jealous. You time. are jealous he because you are hungry and poor, okay, and you mom. will remain your life that's why what is I your problem what's your problem boy? hungry man, boy what is your problem with the mecca what's your problem what's your problem you what's your problem huh tell me 
Hello. Speak back. Goat. Emika has three children. And How do happily married. Okay, Nigerian guy, how do you know that? Since you are an American working in Sweden. <laughs> Doctor, my... How do you know so many to, things I, I about Nigerians? Listen to me. Uh, listen to I me. To Talk like that with mother. Listen to me. Listen to me. <laughs> okay, you enjoy my conversation. Right? Yes, I like... I, 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 I Idiot. That's okay. Um, no, that's your father. Look at you, how ugly you are. One and two. What a what an ugly voice you have. You sound like a goat. The Mecca is right because he heard you. Okay, what's your problem now? <clears throat> why uh why are you fighting with me because of that? Uh, brain. Who stole the money? She never stole the money. How do you know that? She can lie to us. Oh, she can she... lie to her Ah, husband. you are working with her since a lot of uh, years. Ah, uh, understand. No, she can't lie to me. Ah, she can't. Ah, she can't. <laughs> she can't can, lie to she me. Can she can't lie to can me. Lie. Look at you. Yeah, that's my American. Husband. I'm an American working in Sweden, dear baby, my queen, my baby. Go for it. And um, how do you know so many things about Emeka since Emeka didn't talk to you? I'm listening. Give me a proper explanation, you Naija guy. Ah, you you don't know what to what to tell me. Ah, you are talking to your mother. I don't want to talk to you anymore. I don't want to talk. Why? Why are you afraid of me? Idiot. I don't want to talk to you. Why anymore. are you afraid of I me? I just don't want to block you. Are you afraid of me? Okay, how do you know so many things about Emeka since you didn't talk to Emeka? Tell me. Because you pretend you are a smart tell guy. You tell me. I will tell you everything. Because you don't know. know. You know nothing. You know nothing. You are just jealous. You are just jealous. You are jealous like a You are jealous. Shut up. Give me a proper explanation. How? to get information from me. No. No, I don't. I don't want because I visited his family. I know Happy his family. Just a poor want. boy from a village. Where are you from? Delta? Worry, Asaba? Huh? He's gonna use you. Rivers? To up and get you are from the south. Get. Okay, tell me. I need you. Emeka took you to his father and you are happy. You don't know that Emeka's, Emeka's wife is also there in the picture. I will show you. No, she's not. No, huh? she's not. His wife is also there in the picture. And you know why? They're you know what? You I, don't like I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't and care. You let him be. He has his own family. I don't want it. 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 You are jealous because I'm beautiful and rich and I have all I want and you are a Naija boy, Naija boy. <laughs> oh, you are crying. You are crying. I'm laughing. No, you are I'm not crying. laughing. You are crying because you are <laughs> gift card beggar. Gift card beggar. <laughs> Do you want me to send you 10 bucks?
to buy something I'm not like to eat. Make a wish for. I own my own house. I have my own No, house. you have nothing. You have nothing. You have nothing. You have nothing. When you see me, you love me. Trust me. Nah, you, you are too. Talk to me on a video call now. Talk to me on a video call now. Talk to me on a video call now, bro. Mr. Lucas, this is Michael. Why are you trying to tell lies and saying that those pictures are not you? When me and Mr. Mustafa know that that is the picture of you and the other that is working with you. We were telling you not to let us unleash plan number C, but you were too s and too f and you are an your mother means that you don't have any and the maggots will eat. is going to now that we get you out of the way we are going to get mr bob next out of the way and mr mustafa will continue with the plan that he was going to but because you did not listen then this is what happened to you because you're a fool bye mr lucas Lucas, is that you? Yes. What's going on? Said Aris got. To... What? 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 What's that? I'm sorry. You said Aris got to fired. M Mrs. Harris, what? Mrs. Aris got to fired. Yeah. Well, you know, I I, I think it was Michael and. And Mustafa, who were behind that. Good. I told you earlier. I know this is we come up. I told you to work hard and to follow my instruction. If you believe that you send the money to Jennifer, why don't you go to the money where you send the money and tell her to trace the money for you where the money delivered? Why don't you do that? If you trust yourself, if you really say you're saying the truth, you send the money to Jennifer. Why don't you go to the same place where you send the money? Well, that it was through the post for, office. For a proper cop, for proper confirmation, for proper confirmation. Answer, answer to, answer to check in on system for you, because the money is not showing on system. The money is not on system. Why don't you go there and clarify yourself and well, come I, out with the good news? I have. And I, as I wrote to you this morning, the postal inspector is on to Mr. and Mrs. Jennifer. And, no. uh, you know, it, it's not looking good for those two. Okay. You, you told the post office, tell them what happened, and this money is giving you a big problem in where you work. And you yes. got fired because money. Yes. Then Jennifer refused to say that she didn't see any money. And the money don't go to Jennifer May boss. So this money, if you can recover that and get you, you come out with good evidence, I would I know what to tell Mrs. Harris that you'll be called back today. Yes. Because I blocked her. I blocked her off. I've never spoken with her. She's be calling me. She'll be calling me with a different number. As soon as I hear that she's the one calling me, I'll block the same number again. I block Michael, I block uh, the money athlete, I block everybody. Why? Except you. Why? I've never blocked you, but I'm thinking of blocking you. If you didn't come out with good news, I'm going to block you. And anything can happen. If you block me, you'll never find out what what happens I, when I, I, I don't when care. I, I don't want to postal inspector. I am just giving you some few hours. You are the only person I've never blocked. You are the only person I've never blocked. I block everybody. Michael, Mustafa, Salamatu. Manager for money athlete, everybody except you for now. I see, I'll, I'll have my reason why I'll leave you behind for now. Well, it's it's Saturday, and 
the postal inspector won't address this until Monday. Did he act fast? Yesterday, you have the time to do that, but you refuse to do it. You have time well, to I do did. that. I talked to the postal inspector yesterday, so it's now in his hands. If you say, if you claim that you send the money to Jennifer, let her check the money for you, and I need apology to that woman because this woman is crying bitterly that he never saw money. If you really see money, I don't think we will go to this extent. And Michael, I've done the wrong thing at the right time. That is the reason why the whole issue fall back to you and get you affected because you are the one that go to the post office to send the money. Well, I, I think this and woman... The mistake is... you, yes, the mistake you did, you went to lick Michael to... Uh, you know Michael is your enemy and he's my enemy. Michael is working against both of us. Michael sent a lot of voice on that they is going to work against you to take you out of the picture. He recruited me. If Michael is involved in this, then he must be working with Mrs. Jennifer. No. He never knew Jennifer. He doesn't know Jennifer. How is this going to How work How do I me? not know that? How do I not know that? Hold on. This is where you get the OT wrong. You, everybody using assumption. We are assumption. Absorption, that is what you use, that is what Michael is using. Now you are saying Michael is working with Jennifer. How does Michael know Jennifer? You are the one that told Michael that you sent money to me to so so address. How does Michael know? It's through you. So Michael never knew this person before. Even you, you never know this person. Me, I don't know anybody. First, you just gave me address that this is the only trust person that can, that can hold out the money to me and bring it to me safely. That is the reason why I gave you the address to send the money to. I so see. never say, no, never use absorption. Never use absorption to absorb that my, uh, Jennifer received the money and run away with the money. No, she's she's working. She's working in the same company with, with his own husband, same desk. They are using the same desk to work, same place. So you think $2,000 $2, is a problem? You're going to run away with $2,000 and run away with your work? Work, they were paying them $3,000? Well, Why did you do that? Look, look at the test. Know, she, she, she's, she's got her marital she said, problems. She's got no. her marital problems. Stop using assumption. Stop That's using assumption. assumption. You didn't know assumption. Jennifer before? You didn't know Jennifer before? Well, No. Okay, so why did you say they're having a marriage problem? Well, it was the why postal. Did you use such, why did you use such words? It was the why postal Why did you do that? Inspector. Did you know those people before? It you never the, knew them. It was the postal inspector who told me that Mr. Jennifer is a notorious Keep quiet, Mr. Bob. If you say more than this, I'm going to block you. If you say more than this, you stop insulting people. Stop saying different no, words about people insulting. you don't know. You're, 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 you're telling me that I'm judging him based on his... You didn't know those people. You didn't know them. Why don't you, why don't you just keep quiet and I mean, do what you can from I, this? I'm just you don't know them. I don't know them. I'm just so I can't judge them. I'm just surprised that he goes to that club in Seattle and dresses up as...